we are happy to announce the public preview of DAX Query View in Power BI. Make sure you go to the preview features and turn it up for you to be able to use it. Right now, you have the a report that's showing a sales performance summary, and this is a normal Power BI report. But if you look at this, the fourth icon, you're going to see Dark Square Review. Click on it, then it's going to bring you to another new interface that has the tables and the models. In the tables, you have the different tables that you have within your report, and also you have your models. Now, if you're here, you can see the facts right now. You can see a simple evaluate that that we've done here. When you right click facts, you're going to see quick queries. Now, your quick queries, you can see show the top 100 rows, and this is it. I can click on it, and it shows the top 100 rows. I can right click it also again, and I can say show the column statistics or define all measures within the model now we want to be able to evaluate from scratch we want to be able to do um, a little bit of dax query from scratch so you're going to click on new query now let's do a simple um, query and for every query you need to have the evaluate function so i'm going to type evaluate now let's evaluate just only fact table so i'm going to evaluate the fact table and i'm going to click run and this is it it's as simple as that but let's go further to say we want to summarize this fact table to give us the location and the sales um, by that location so let's say this is summer evaluate i'm going to click and say okay summarize for me now we'll have the facts already we're going to do comma and we're going to click now which of the we want it to be location so we're going to type location i will click state and we we'll put your comma well remember it's still asking us for um column or group id sometimes you want to but right now we don't want to use another column name but we want to use um the name and the expression that's what we want to focus on so which name do we want to give it by giving it a sales sales by states comma and now the expression right now so we want it we want a sales the sales and we close the brackets and we click run that is it and you can see location by um sales by location and but one of the beautiful things about the dax query view is the format um query you can format it to improve readability and right now we're just going to click format and we are cool and this is introduction to dax query view